Do you think I'll be playing wrong a Megadeth song in front of Dave Mustaine for over three years or over 300 concerts? Well, I don't think so, but some guys were commenting that I was playing wrong the riff of Tornado of Souls. So a, a while ago, I, I did a video playing the entire song and there I was reading the comments and uh, some guy saying, uh, was saying that I played wrong and should be all down strokes or something like that. So I decided to do a video explaining why I don't play down strokes all the time. Basically, that's the concept of Megadeth, not playing down strokes all the time. Because the down strokes all the time gives you a certain kind of sound and that's it. So you have two ways of playing metal riffs, only the down strokes that gives you this machine gun, very uh, precise and straightforward, very sharp kind of sound, uh, something like that. That's one way, you know, straight, straightforward down strokes all the time. Another way would be up and down, alternate picking. And uh, that the alternate picking gives you other, other possibilities. Um, you can play more groovy, let's say. You can ex give some different accents because you're playing up and down and the sound of the down and the up, they're different. So it's not so precise, but it gives you like a different vibe. It's more human, let's say. So, uh, so it's good when you balance both styles and create riffs using both ideas. So the same riff with uh, up and down would be something like. Can you hear the difference? So one is very precise, the other one is more groovy. So Tornado of Souls, what we do is like the B here, we play, you know, the machine gun like, you know, very precise. And then here is the groovy part. So you have. Right? So that's it. That's my answer to the comments that I was playing wrong. I think it's a great tip. And now we can listen to all the Megadeth riffs. And now we're going to realize when it's the downstrokes and when it's the groovy, uh, shuffling, pushing up and down uh, kind of pattern. All right? So leave your comments. Let me know what you want to learn. Subscribe to the channel. Activate the notifications. And uh, see you in the next video. Cheers.